Unlocking the phrase, bring it on home. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase, bring it on home. This might sound a bit confusing at first, but don't worry, we'll explore its meaning, usage, and origins together. So, let's bring it on home with this lesson. Bring it on home is a phrase that has both a literal and a figurative meaning. Literally, it means to physically bring something to one's home or residence. For example, after shopping, don't forget to bring it on home. However, more interestingly, it's often used figuratively. In a non-literal sense, bring it on home means to complete a task with great success, to finish something strongly, or to make a point clear and convincing. It's like saying, finish this in a very effective or impressive way. Let's see how this phrase works in different contexts. 1. In sports, imagine a basketball game where a team is close to winning. A fan might shout, bring it on home, urging the team to secure the victory. 2. In a presentation, if someone is giving a compelling presentation, a colleague might whisper, you're doing great. Now bring it on home, meaning to conclude the presentation powerfully. 3. In everyday conversation, if a friend is explaining a plan or an idea, you might say, sounds good, but can you bring it on home? Asking them to make their point more clearly or to conclude their explanation, The phrase likely originated from American English and gained popularity through music and sports. It's a common expression in songs, emphasizing the idea of returning or concluding with passion. In sports, it's used to encourage a strong finish. Bring it on home resonates with the idea of completing something with enthusiasm and effectiveness. And that's a wrap on bring it on home. We hope this video helped you understand this interesting phrase and how you can use it in different scenarios. Remember, language is not just about words. It's about expression and emotion. Keep practicing, and soon you'll be bringing it on home in your English conversations. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next lesson.